Well, yeah, we're going to have one floor obviously here at noon, and we should have. We've had a task force that's been looking into the redistricting over the last uh, couple of months. Uh, we hope to comprise that redistricting task force into a committee to have them uh, originate and consider inter inter origination of a bill. Uh, hopefully, they'll meet as early as this afternoon to start going through the. the uh, maps, the, the districts, and uh, I think we've got an overall general consensus uh, based upon the discussions that have been held at, as a result of many of the public hearings and the discussions between the senators and both in the, in, within districts and in the adjoining regions. So I think we've, we've got a pretty good idea. I expect that there'll be three bills, one out of the Senate, one for the House, and probably then a uh, congressional one as well. Uh, we'll probably try to get the each of the House's uh, affairs in order first before we divert our attention to national issues. Do you think that might be a little bit contentious there? Because I know oh, there's a couple be. plans. Yeah, there could be. There's always plans. Uh, you know, there's, uh, you know, the, we're going to try to do something that meets constitutional muster and also provides for one man, one vote. So one man, one woman, one vote. As much as possible. Those are the polar stars. And uh, to try to keep them in the uh, regions of the state that make sense that uh, have uh, some common interests, common uh, common industry, business, and uh, affiliations, etc. So it'll work out. It always does. How long do you think it'll take? Do you think through the weekend or before? I'm hopeful that we can get it done by the end of the week. That's our plan. That's our goal. And that's uh, our preliminary time schedule. We'd like to be out of here by the end of the week.